everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today, we are a little dysfunctional. I looked like crap two seconds ago, threw down my hair, put some lipstick on, and bada bing, bada boom. It's amazing what makeup and um, just a little zhuzhing will do for you. Let's just say that. Had a great nap, by the way. This week has been so weird for me. I, it's probably the weather. The weather outside is frightful. I don't know the rest of that song. So today I have my January favorites. It's February 2nd, and I have a whole shit ton of stuff for you. Um, I have a lot of stuff to show you guys. To show you I can't even speak today. Um, yesterday I had my tooth drilled in, so it hurts a little bit, but I haven't filmed for you guys in a little bit of time, so I figured, suck it up, Delphine. Film for them, you know what I mean? So that's what we're doing today. Okay. So this is a brush cleaner and it's by Trish McAvoy. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but my mom actually gave this to me and I love it because I don't have to dampen my beauty blender and the sink anymore. I can just spritz this and I'm good to go. I mean, I do need like a napkin to like squeeze out the excess uh, stuff coming out of it, but that's okay. It's, it's really convenient and I love it. Another favorite is the beauty blender. I finally bought one in December and I love it. I love it. Okay, moving on. Um, I got the big Laura Mercier uh, translucent powder and I love this stuff so freaking much. If you don't have this, you need to buy it. Um, I've been kind of experimenting with baking lately and this does a really, really good job, especially with the Beauty Blender and with Trish McAvoy. <laughs> All this together is just flawless. Um, but I really like this stuff. It's a little pricey, but it's worth it because there's a lot in it. This is the Shimmering Skin Perfector in Moonstone by Becca, and it's absolutely stunning. I love it so much. I don't have any on today because, um, yeah, that didn't do much. <laughs> I did have Opal for the longest time, and this, they're both amazing. I wish I could buy both, but your girl's broke. She's not broke. She's saving money. And I really love what's on my lips right now. This is a ColourPop lippy stick in Lady. It's so pretty. It's a beautiful berry brown color, and I think it's really pretty. Okay, moving into skincare. So, like I mentioned, I just bought a new skincare regimen today. So, I just wanted to share it with you guys just because, I don't know, maybe you guys have tried it, but this is the Origins Zero Oil line and it helps with minimizing pores and my pores have been like out of control lately so I thought I would try this out because my skincare line just hasn't been working as well anymore and I'm thinking it's because of my beauty blender to be honest like I'm thinking about it and I'm like dang girl you need to wash that so as for eye makeup remover I got this um, with my little gift for having so many points at Sephora and this is the Lancome uh, by facial um, eye makeup remover. It's really gentle and so nice. Love this stuff. I want to buy the full, full, full thing of it. The full, full, full thing, not just the full thing. So I found my sugar lip polish by Fresh and um, it's just the brown sugar one and I love it. It's so ni It's so nice in the winter time especially. When I put this on before I put my lip balm on, love it. Amazing stuff. Love, love, love. And then, because I'm trying to be a little proactive with uh, aging, because your girl's 24 this year, what the heck? That is the weirdest thing of my life. Um, but this is the Clinique Smart Custom Repair Serum, and I put this on last after moisturizer, after everything, and I just put it on my forehead. You know, I don't think it's working, but I put it there just to say that I'm being proactive about aging. So this is the Lancome Eye Cream, and I got it again in that uh, point thing with Sephora. I love this stuff. It just feels good under your eyes. Even if it's not working, it feels good. Um, I actually, you know, it's hard to tell because I don't have that many wrinkles, so it's hard to see if it's actually working. Um, but when I get old, I'll pop this bad boy out again. We'll see what happens. But again, it's a preventative, so maybe it will work. We'll see when I'm 40. <laughs> Then I uh, got this a while ago. This is the Glam Glow Flash Mud Brightening Treatment. And I used it the other night and it was really nice. It felt amazing on the skin. Again, don't know if it did much. I don't think the Glam Glow things do much. I think they just feel really good on the skin, but hey, that's worth it to me. Um, I do wanna buy 
the other versions, um, like the blue one looks really fun. This one wasn't as fun as those ones, so I can't wait to try those. I went to TJ Maxx looking for a body lotion because they always have body shop stuff there. And I found this body shop aloe soothing body butter and it's amazing. It feels like heaven on my skin. It just like melts it. Oh God. And last but not least for beauty products is this Wild Bloom perfume. Really funny. I just got this for Christmas from my stepsister. So nice, by the way. She didn't need to send me anything. I didn't send her anything. It's one of those things. It's like, oh, she's not going to send me anything. It's fine. It's fine. Because she lives on the other side of the country. So it's like, and then she sent me something and I was really upset with her, but she's so sweet for doing it. Um, this is a Banana Republic perfume and Sam Sherman here on YouTube. Um, love her, by the way. Um, she said she found this at TJ Maxx for 15 bucks. So go check out your TJ Maxx. I'm telling you, TJ Maxx has amazing stuff. This smells incredible. It's my favorite scent of all time. It doesn't last all day, but I love it. And for a candle of the month, this is the White Rose um, Richly Scented Candle by DW Home. Um, Smells incredible, smells like a white rose. I always put this on when my brides come over. It's kind of like a nice like, welcome into the bridal room, you know what I mean? Um, yeah, TJ Maxx again. I get everything from TJ Maxx. So for jewelry favorites, this is a, I think I've showed this before. Um, but anyway, this is a bracelet from Gypset Co. It's adorable, gorgeous, the crystal is amazing. But I will leave everything down below because she has like a pop-up store in Florida. So if you're around her area, go check it out. I can't check it out because I don't live in Florida. So I'm like, what the heck? Um, but yeah, Gypset Co. And then I've been on a huge like stone kick when it comes to jewelry. And I found this little cute ring here. And it, um, I got it at a thrift store. I don't know if it's real. But if it's not, who cares? Super cute. I've been loving trucker hats lately. This one I just got in Napa. It says American Runner. Um, it's a running hat and I just love it. I'm American. God bless America. And then this one is a North Face hat that I got um, from one of my gigs. So really nice hat. I'm getting into the last couple of things, which is food. Um, this is Blue Agave. It's organic from Safeway. Just bought it from Safeway. I put this in my tea, my coffee, my oatmeal. I put this in everything. It's so good. One tablespoon is 60 calories. Um, it's pretty high in sugar, but hey, you need a little bit of sugar in your life, sugar. You know what I mean? But I love agave better than honey. It just has a sweeter taste to me. So these are go-go squeezies, squeezes. They're for children, but they're so easy to grab and go and they're only 60 calories for a pouch. And it's just like a nice little quick snack to make your day so much better. Love these things. Target, got a whole box at Target. For Christmas, I got this tea sampler and there's a particular tea in here that I absolutely love and it's called Earl Grey. And it says that it's fully fermented black tea with an aromatic bergamot oil flavor. <laughs> a lot of words um, but they come in these little pouches really nice I have a little tiny cup that I use because there's not much tea in it so it's the perfect amount and um, yeah love black tea and last but not least I forgot about this little guy this is called a gingin and these are chewy ginger candies if you don't like ginger stay clear these are spicy but they're so good and gooey and chewy so good so Try them if you can. They have different flavors. They have peach, mango, everything. These are the original, which I love. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching my January favorites. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know which one, which of everything was your favorite. And thumbs up this video if you want to see more from me. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye!